Autry National Center recently hosted a reception to welcome their new executive director and CEO, W. Richard West, Jr. I want everybody who understands Native cultures through our lens to know that we are peoples and communities with a deep and expansive history in this place and in this hemisphere. Well, this is a really a glorious occasion to celebrate Rick West, one of our, my own tribal tri uh, people, uh, to be the uh, president of the uh, Autry National Center. It's just not overwhelming, but very proud. It's a proud moment to have, to have one of your own, as well as an Indian person, uh, be in, in, in charge of something so magnificent. The FNX team was fortunate enough to interview Mr. West about the museum, as well as his professional journey. As a lawyer, I was at the matter of trying to protect the jurisdictional authorities of Native peoples and Native communities. It's important. We are different from other ethnic groups in the United States. We have a legal and constitutional basis for existing. We were defined as nations in many, in many respects. And so we govern territory, we govern people. But all of that is to the end, if you will. All of that political, constitutional, and legal tradition is to the end of protecting distinct ways of cultural living. And so my view was that, as a lawyer, what I was ultimately working for is that the cultural integrity of contemporary Native peoples and communities could be protected going forward. And that's what brought me to museums. Rick is a very kind man, he's very warm, and he's so impressive to listen to him speak and just captivates every audience that he speaks to. And and um, from our board to our visitors, and I think everyone really understands how wise and how smart he is, uh, but also how visionary he really is for the institution. For me, being being Cherokee, and uh, I, I think that uh, we can look forward to a lot here at the Audrey, and uh, me personally, I'm looking forward to visiting as often as I can, and, and uh, looking forward to the next few years, uh, and seeing what, what comes of it. It's just a natural for him to be in a facility like this, an institution. I mean, to me, it is an icon. It is exactly what um, Mrs. Autry and, and Jean Autry wanted as a museum. And it's here, it's alive, it's well, and it's just going to get better. The Autry is the next step. It assumes that we have achieved some kind of equality in terms of the voices that are represented at the table of interpretation in a museum. And now we are trying to tell how in this city, in this region, in the American West, which has so much to do with uh, the heart of American history and development, that we describe and tell those rich and diverse stories about how these various communities touched each other, sometimes tragically, but sometimes in very productive ways that have created the fabric of American cultural heritage.